Hey, love bugs. It's Robin back at you one more again. I hope you, everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same for you. Hope you enjoyed your Easter weekend. I know I did. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you have not already, please like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love to get the positive feedback, especially on the content of what you might be going through or resonating with the video that I'm doing today. And if you feel like you enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up, like, or even share. It'll greatly be appreciated. And thanks once again for coming to my channel. And for my returning subs, what's up fam? Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you so much for taking the time out and coming to see about my video today. And my video today is about Twin Flame 101 Room. Hey, Oka's when reality hits. Like today, I'm listening to the perfect meditation music. It's like, what is it called? Meditation music, mind, body, positive energy, relaxing music. Yes, it was really good. It's just, you know, like you got hearing those like Tibet bowls or whatever you're you know you're listening to and it's just very relaxing but yeah when reality hits you know there's some things that we go through we'll just sweep up under the rug and talk about oh we'll deal with them later you know and it's just like with us we will have a bad habit of wanting to take other people's problems on but we are not able because we don't sometimes we'll take on other people's problems so we don't have to deal with our own and it's just that is a not so good thing <laughs> it is not a so good thing because i had learned from the hard way from me being a child I, I mean even in nightmares i was always running from something and never realized or recognized what i was running from you know and nowadays now we got technology we can look up our dreams we can look up our synchronicities you know we need to recognize them for what they are you know and it's just like like i tell you in so many of my videos it's just like sometimes we feel like life has been handed to us like the ishy stick and but it's basically the world responding to us on what we're giving out you know because right now it's been for me it's been peaceful but even though i'm not where i want to be at you know it's been peaceful but it's been very emotional because like i said in my other video that i said from yesterday i'm regenerating so it's just like I have to face everything for what it is, you know, I have to sit up here and look, you know, your family altering your life, you know, they tried their, their best to wipe out your, mem your, your memory, you know, they were hoping that you would have committed suicide so they could be able to take on, you know, something that never belonged to them, and it, it's just like, I had to really face all those horrible things that I went through, and the things that I contributed, contributed to my situation you know i ran away from it even though you know i had to face the facts and live with every day that my dad has been here you know my my adopted family had asked me you know you want to come over here we have a surprise for you but with my situation i couldn't hold that guilt in even though i had to live with that for the rest of my life i couldn't hold that guilt in because they weren't honest you know they were very deceptive about the situations that they would put me in to make me doubt what they had for me just for me to turn away because they knew what they were doing you know anybody that you know that wants to go out their way and make sure that you're happy and make sure that you're secure even with a situation like that me and my my daughters would have never had a worry in the world but we all had to go through our learning process. We all had to go through our things. And it's just like, I can't keep pointing the fingers at them. Even though what they did was wrong, I can't dwell off of that. I said, I'm not going to put my energy in it anymore. You know, even though it hurts me a lot, you know, it, it's like, look at the situation you're in. Look at how many lives you're helping. Look at how many people are coming to you and helping you heal. And it's just like, even with the viewers, you, you, um, you don't realize as much as you know I'm going out and making these videos to help you you're helping me also because it's just like sometimes we need to hear that little voice that says you know what you, you 
know, you've been through a lot or, you know what, I get what you're saying. I, you know, I've been through that, you know, or, you know, I resonate with what you're going through. And sometimes I needed to hear that, you know, to get, you know, let me know, hey, you know what I'm doing? I'm on my right path. I'm on my calling. I'm not resisting anymore, you know, and I'm, you know, you look in reality, I'm looking at that heifer on her face and I'm just like, you know what, what else do you have? What else have you taken from me? And, but I'm still here. You know, what was meant to kill me? I, you know, I did, you know, I'm, I'm just taking the bull by his horns and, you know, I'm dealing with it and letting it go. I'm not coping. I'm dealing, you know, you never want to cope with anything because it's just like, you never really get over it, you know, and it's just like, you know, I can't change anything from the past. I can't, even though I felt like I've lost so much, but I just know that I gained so much also from this situation. And it, it's just like, I'm going to be okay. You know, even though I, it's just like, it's a blessing to have my viewers tell me, you know, I pray for you and I hope the best for you. And, you know, I hope, you know, these good things happen for you. And that's a blessing to me. So, and it's just like when you need that recognition to let you know, you know, even though reality sits in and it lets you know, you know, you've been through this and this and this and that. Don't come become a victimizer of the things that you've been through, even though it might be a sad situation. But it's like, yeah, I've been through this. And, you know, when I think about my dad, I cry sometimes because, you know, even though we didn't have a really honest relationship because it was like, you know, we... I wasn't able to say this. He wasn't able to say that. And it was a really hard situation, but it's just the fact is no matter how much they tried to keep us away, you know, we always had always had that bond, even though it was spiritual or metaphysically or whatever. I have to cherish that. And so those are the things that I'd rather sit there and listen to, you know, listen to in my head. Because, you know, so a lot of times when we have reality sits in, our ego starts messing with us, the negative thoughts come up, the negative memories come up, you get in a funk, you know, and it's just a lot of things that we have to deal with and just take it by the, you know, just take it face on, take it head on, like, okay, you know, even though this has happened to me, I'm still here. I might be bumped and bruised, a little bit broken, but you're not, you know, you're, you're fixable. <laughs> you're not broken, broken, but you're fixable. So I'm not trying to hold you up, you know, just let, you know, you know, when, when you have reality steps in, recognize it for what it is. You know what you need to change. You know what you need to let go. You know what you need to enhance. The only person that can stop you is you. And don't let you do that. And I will talk to you later. Much love. Keep me in your prayers. And I will definitely keep you in mind. And I hope everybody has a blessed week. And I will talk to you on my next video. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell. And I will talk to you later. Peace. And be wild.